hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and in today's video i'm going to be doing another protective hairstyle so this is how my hair is looking currently i have a lot of growth going on i can't even see my scalp so i'm thinking this is gonna be my last protective hairstyle before i go ahead and relax i'm just trying to stretch it to like four months anyways today i'm going to be doing some spring twist i just wanted something short something bouncy something cute and something that won't like put too much stress onto my hair like even if i tie them they're not as tight as like some of my previous hairstyles these are the spring twists that i have the uh the brand is called foxen these are spring twists and these are 10 inches and they're in the color 1b and 30 and i got two of them so this is how they look out of the box so pretty and bouncy they're so beautiful and again this is number 1b and 30 so as always i'm gonna go ahead and start from the back and then i'll catch up with you guys when i get to the front i'm done with the back and this is how they're looking they are so springy so i'm just gonna turn and show you guys the back so this is how they're looking at the back nice and bouncy super super light though like they feel so natural so i am back now i am done with this side so i'm only left with this side here so i'm gonna show you like what i've been doing and all the products that i've been using because i do have like some growth and it's a little bit hard to comb and i don't want to comb like dry hair and cause another breakage the first product that i'm using is this dark and lovely olive oil moisturizer so i'm just trying to get it mostly like on the roots because it's a little bit hard to comb and i'm also leaving out my edges because i don't like to pull them and i've been using this um iso plus hairline edge and holding gel it's absolutely amazing i got this one from clicks it smells amazing like it smells absolutely amazing and i love that it doesn't leave the cast doesn't have like the white cast after that it's just shiny and smooth and smells amazing just apply it on the line here comb it through so the first one i'm going to have two braids so i've been separating the spring twist into two so first i like stretch it out so that it's easy to separate without being um, tangled and then I just go in the middle and separate it in half like so this much and I just go ahead and start braiding so I'm gonna start braiding with my hair and the two strands so here I'm just doing like a three strand braid nothing special the only different from other twists that i've done in the past is that i am braiding like a little bit more like i'm making it like a longer braid than i would normally do and reason being because this is like spring twists are really really soft so they can so because i have relaxed short hair they can like slide out if they're not tight enough right in the bottom so that's why i'm braiding like this much normally i will just braid like half of this and could start twisting but because it, this is spring twist and they're soft so that's why i kind of have to braid a little bit more and then after that i just take my hair with one of the braid and then twist it together to kind of like seal it in place and just start twisting with the two braids like so and i'm also making sure that my hair is not sticking out i mean some areas it is sticking out because i was not paying attention but that's not a big deal it can be concealed with the mousse and then after that i just continue twisting you don't really have to twist you kind of just like twist it together in a way but not not as tight because it's already curled so it's just gonna twist on its own 
so i just continue twisting until i get to the end of the braid and it does get tangled a lot especially like in the ends here i'm not sure if it's because of the color and they tend to stick to each other so what i've been doing is when i get to the end like here like so i will just snip off the access piece and leave it and then it will just like bounce back on its own so taking the other half and my hair first i like to just wrap it on and then just continue braiding like so so just braid and like if you have shorter hair than mine you might as well just braid until you get to the hair like that's what i did at the back i just braided until i got to the hair and then uh started twisting after that but here because my hair is a little bit longer right here in the front it's still short but um i'm not braiding like all the way to my hair so after braiding just continue twisting like it, it's basically just like wrapping it i'm not really like twisting i'm kind of just like wrapping it together it's not like senegalese twist like i said i am separating the strands into two so that's why i have like this sort of like um distressed um messy uh, spring twist but if you want like the cleaner spring twist like the tight ones you might want to use a full um, braid without separating so again when i get to the end snip off the access and it just kind of like spring back i'm just gonna continue doing my hair like the same and you guys can just chill and watch
and I'm also taking some serum this one is by Afro True just like few pumps and I'm going to just apply on top to give it a little bit more shine and I'm also taking my ORS Repset Mousse and I'm going to take like a handful and just put it on top to get rid of like any flyaways just get everything laying nice and smooth so yeah this is how they're looking i'm gonna show you the back and this is how it's looking it's so full but it's not heavy so yeah this is the final look i am so in love with them like i thought they would be like too much like they're actually like really really breathable like it's not too hot in there and yeah they're perfect it's perfect for the weather because it's really really hot so yeah i love them i love the color i love the length this is by a brand called queenie hair queen hair queenie hair queenna queenna hair and these are in 10 inches and they were like super easy to achieve this took me about six hours to complete and i am so in love with them so i will list all the products that i use in the description box below and uh including the hair unfortunately i got the hair from baby in kempton park it's a smaller type of um hair store but if you know Kempton Park you would find it unfortunately they do not have an online store I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you guys on my next one bye